Hey vlog, it is currently like 6.30 in the morning and I just got off work, but I just came out here to vent a little bit because like, I don't really have nobody to talk to. I don't really want to talk to nobody today, not at all. Like my attitude is just, it's one of them days now. And plus I just got my period like a day ago. So everything is bothering me, but this right here is really bothering me. So. I'm at work or whatever. I go to work at night. I work overnight, 10, 10 p.m. to 6 a.m. I work for a security company, so I relieve somebody before, well, before I start my shift. So I, it was this one lady that I was relieving at first, and she was like complaining about me being two minutes late. So she, um, eventually she stopped complaining about that because it's two minutes. But then she started complaining about other stuff like me using her tissue and all of that, and uh, so um she was she was rude to everybody really so she got removed from that site so then now it's another lady there she was there too before and i was telling her about the other lady that got fired okay so i'm gonna call this lady oh the lady who got um, removed from the site i'm gonna call her patrick and this lady could be called spongebob so um spongebob now has a problem with me because she's she keeps calling the manager saying that I'm always being late and all this and that so I don't understand how I keep being late if when I get there she's never there she leaves five minutes early or whatever because she have a different job so she's not really there every time I get to work so what are you steady calling the managers for telling them that I'm late and I don't be late. You could act like I even told my supervisor, like you could ask anybody at the site. If I am late, it's like three minutes, two minutes. You have a five minute grace period to be at work. I don't give a fuck what rules the managers try to make up for themselves. But she keep the the supervisor at this job keeps telling me I have to be there at 955. If my schedule say 10 o'clock, that's what time I'm going to be there. And if I'm one or two minutes late, it's not a problem because it's a five minute grace period. But I swear, they just going to make me quit. Seriously, like they going to make me find a different site. And I told her that because she came in here today talking about um, SpongeBob is saying that I'm always late and this and that. And she was just trying to get rowdy with me. So I got back rowdy with her and she's talking about. Um, she's, she don't want to get loud with me and have attitude. I don't care what you do because y'all finna stop harassing me talking about I'm late and I don't be late. Like you could check the, the clock in system. I don't, I don't know what to do at this point because everything I'm going through a lot right now. I have a lot on my plate. I have a lot to do, a lot to fo focus on and So basically, I'm just releasing my anger right here. I understand that people got stuff going on, but I do too. And it's like, in my mind, I already knew that it was going to be something when I got to work because I instantly prayed when I got to work that God would get me out of this job. Like, I'm really freaking tired of the people that work. It's not even the the job. The job is easy. It's the people that I work with. The site is okay. I'm cool. I don't like work, working overnight, but I still come to work every day. I have not missed any day since I started working. <laughs> except for my birthday and they keep harassing me about being two and three minutes late it's making me want to report them for antagonizing and harassing me i'm finna get ready and switch my site I, I'm, I'm actually looking for a new job because i can't do this no more because <laughs> it's causing me to be really angry and upset like you see i'm crying right now i'm probably just crying because i'm on my period but <laughs> It's, it's just overwhelming and to hear this every week 
SpongeBob don't even be at work when I get there. She leaves five minutes early. So I feel like she's trying to start stuff with me. I'm just going to ask to be removed from this site because she's causing causing me problems. And I'm finna cause a real problem in a second. When I explain this to my supervisor, she don't care what I'm saying. She basically telling me that I need to be there at 9.55. I'm not coming to work five minutes early just because she got a different... Just because Spongebob works some, somewhere else and she got to be at her other job. She needs to be focused on having one job then if she can't prioritize or organize her schedule. Because just because she works somewhere else, that don't got nothing to do with me. I got stuff going on at home. And I'm stressed out. I'm tired. I'm on my period. I got to do hella shit. I'm barely getting any fucking sleep. I'm mad. I'm, I'm fucking mad only thing that's calming me down is God, seriously. But I just had to come and vent. I just can't do this no more. I don't even like crying to people or on camera, but I had to let that out because I'm angry. So yeah, but that's my little venting session. I'm going to bed. What's up, Oak? I'm currently driving right now because we're getting our lashes done today. Cause baby, these lashes wispy as hell. Let me explain what this is, because I know y'all probably like, what the fuck is that on her face? So, um, when they get cold outside, my lips be getting so freaking dry that if I crack it, this is what happens. Like, if I open my mouth and this part crack, you know what happened. Well, some of y'all probably don't get dry um, lips or dry skin, period, but I'm trying to clear it up. But I done peeled it off and all type of stuff. So I'm really hoping that this ugly ass bruise go away or whatever you want to call it. Because that looks so ugly and it's messing up my face. Yeah, if it don't if it don't go away soon, I'm gonna go to the doctor and have them handle it. But I just been um putting some little cream on it to try to see if it'll go away first. And yes, I do have eczema. My skin is prone to it. I've been having eczema since I was a kid, so it's nothing new, but I just never had eczema on my face, so that's disturbing. I'm finna get some gas, and then after I get some gas, I'm finna go to my lash appointment, and then we're gonna get our eyebrows done today too, because we ain't doing this whole grizzly bell look again. But other than that, yeah, that's that's what we're doing today on this little journey. So stay tuned. I'm outside in a damn jeep, right outside. Baby girl, you know me Still with the dolls that I grew beside All the niggas proud me, I did it die Gotta watch the time, cause it's flying right by I'm outside in an AMG Right outside, DT Two-turn, baby girl, you know me Shorty off a fence, star Just the one I'm ready, it's a pressure Waited, I've been living, I've been finishing up I'm just trying to make it to the end, you know Certain things have started getting pissed off Think we need to have a sudden adventure I could be a man, but maybe down the road Right now, I would rather see my heart turn to gold Rather see my heart turn to crystal Inside a crib on my own Soon as I feel up, I'm about to pop up on your phone Like, I'm outside in an AMG Right outside, PT Two-turn, baby girl, you know me Who am I? All the niggas around me, right in the dark Gotta watch your time, cause it's flying right by Two-turn, baby girl, you know me Outside. What's up vlog? I'm back. I don't know if I showed y'all a good view of my lashes, but they are giving. 
Um, I didn't get a chance to go and get my eyebrows and my nails done because I had to come back and do hair. I forgot I had a claim today. So I just got that done and I'm about to get ready and go to work now. I'm just like a naked jacket. That's really my jacket, but it's just, I'm like a real small person. So it's kind of big, but, um, yeah, so I'm about to get ready and go to work. The lashes is giving y'all. I'm in love. Shout out to my my. I'm gonna put her Instagram. Okay, let me not do that. I just snatched one off. Um, I'm gonna put her Instagram down below. But um, like I was saying though, what was I saying? Oh, shout out to Maya though. I'm gonna put her Instagram down below. Make sure y'all follow her on Instagram. Follow her business page. She be snapping on lashes. She be doing her thing. As you can see, dolled up per and um yeah so i get back with y'all tomorrow when i get off work because i'm gonna get out go to work <sighs> tomorrow i'm gonna call these jobs that i fill out applications for because like i'm really trying to get out the job seriously i cannot i will not i will not <laughs> but um yeah so see y'all tomorrow what i'm doing right now is it's cold as fuck that's that's what it is but um <laughs> It's cold and it's raining, and me, Maya, and Melina are about to go to Chinatown and try some pho. I think that's how you say it, pho. So, um, I hate sitting on my brakes because when I look and turn, that should be yanking. But yeah, we finna go down to Chinatown and try some pho, and then we are going to split apart, but I wanted to bring y'all along on this journey because... That's what I'm gonna be doing this year is trying different foods that I don't usually try. So stay tuned for that. I wonder if you are supposed to eat the lettuce with this. Because why are we on there? So I've got three chicken fries. Ooh, yeah. Wait, hold on. Let me put my stuff up in my. Not all of it, but you know. I love. 
Eat the chicken skin. Eat the chicken. Girl, that eat the bite. Eat the whole thing. A bigger bite. Look, eat it. 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 Put some of the chili sauce on it. Yeah, put some I don't feel comfortable. The hot sauce. Y'all. My thoughts is running wild. Put some hot sauce on it. You see how my friends peer pressure me? This should be illegal. Put some hot sauce on it. Dip it in there. Yeah, dip it. Get like a nice. Yeah, you need a lot of it though. Girl, she must be hot. <laughs> I don't like it. <laughs> Hold on, let me get. Girl, I'm trying to get all my little salami. Y'all, so we just finished eating pho. Three day, out of a nine and ten, I would say. I mean, out of a nine. Yeah. I give it like a seven. Damn. Yeah, you give it. You give it that. That's the average. Oh, it's like average. Yeah, it is. It's not. Yeah, I say like seven. Oh, the pho, the pho. I get a pho. A seven point five. I give it a seven. The dumpling. What is in there? What is the what is the <laughs> curious the curious chunky pieces out of nowhere? What is it? Cause I ordered veggie and uh, I'm still having chunks. I don't know what the chunks is. Please tell me. Please tell me. Please. Yeah, I don't know about that one, baby. I have some chicken skin. Yeah, they was eating chicken skin. How 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 do y'all rate the chicken skin? Oh. One out of one. I mean, one out of two. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna be respectful and just say, uh, it just, a one. It was given I don't like the it. chicken skin that we really need. But the crunchy. crunchy. I like the crunchy. Like yeah. Wait, why my camera looks so blurry? Is this lighting? <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm gonna show you the chicken skin. Yeah, that's what I like. Yeah, that's what I like. 
but yeah, yeah. Um, if it had like lemon pepper and like some more seasoning on it, it would most likely be good. I kind of think it tastes like gizzards, but I like gizzards. I don't know what that tastes like, and I don't think I would know what it I don't want to know what that tastes like, and I, they forced me to eat chicken skin. And I ain't feel comfortable eating all that, and I somebody just I just don't. Y'all take them home, y'all. I'm gonna get a batter Y'all say bye to the camera. Bye. We gonna take home these good sauces though. Yeah. Hey, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Esther. Lucky charm. Yeah, it's lucky charm. So we finna take three pieces, which is these three. And for three, it means to stimulate the mind. Mm -hmm. All it right. tastes good. I like it. It tastes that good. It tastes like. It, it tastes, tastes like, like something. Cereal. Yeah, it tastes like. It's sweet. Something I had before. It tastes like a Kit Kat. It's good though. I can low key sit here and eat some more. Yeah, okay. Walls gonna be melting. <laughs> okay. <laughs> because one to three pieces stimulates the mind. Four to nine pieces is therapeutic, is mindful and elevated. And God mode is the 10 to 15 pieces walls might melt. That's the three pieces? Stimulate the mind. It's a micro dose. I might I, just take one more piece. Because uh -huh. <laughs> what is they for the four? Four to nine people, mindful and elevated. Might as well. Let yeah. me take a big one. Nobody, us. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well. Trying to elevate our minds around this piece. Okay. And y'all, I don't do shrooms a lot. Last time Neither. I did shrooms was on New Year. That's not going to be like no habit for me, but. Oh my gosh. I did shrooms last time around this time last year. And that was an actual mushroom, like. That shit was taste like earth. <laughs> Consume yeah. slowly in a safe environment. Slowly. Do not operate we just any. Over and touch it. <laughs> it is like do not operate any motor vehicles, baby. I'm finna drown. Okay. One thing about it, don't ever take nothing without reading the instructions first. Please don't, cause Jesus. the first time I took uh, shrooms, I was driving back home. It felt like I was in a Mario Kart like video game. Yes. Light <laughs> blink like GM. The color blue and green was what was like sticking out the most to me. I thought I was like, I like this. It's a little fun. Wait, you know how when you go to the to a 3D movie without the glasses, that's how everything looks. Mm -hmm. like, I everything swear to God. So weird and like, like it was just coming out of the Yeah, like, like it was very like I don't know how to how to explain it, but if this object and if Janae Aiko be feeling this shit, I like it. I'm probably gonna go home and paint. Ooh. I wanna do something or like that. Draw or something. I wish I was artistic. Girl, I don't know where this shit came from. I look he been have, doing art. Well, I don't know. I think my nephew taught me how to draw when I was like eight. But I've been having art class since I was like in middle school. I used to make um in high school I used to make um bowls and ashtrays but I, i'm screaming my I teacher to too. <laughs> she she was letting me slide the first couple ones but until i made like a big ass bowl like that big i had like the little nozzle and everything she was like okay now you're kind of yeah you're doing too much like so she told me i had to stop but oh that's what we should do one day y'all go to a ceramics to a place pottery, yeah and yeah, we some, should. Some little bowls or vases or some shit. Like the glass one? Like, yeah. it's called glass blowing or something like that? No, glass blowing is different. Oh. Um, it's like ceramic rug. Oh, yeah, lashes by my mind. Period. Period. <laughs> Use her referral for 15% off. Period. Period. Oh, yeah, we in Chicago with it, too. Yes, yes, yes. 
Shite rack, shite rack, shite. So, I ain't gonna be with Maya later. But she finna go home and I'm finna go home. Yes. I'm sure I'm gonna send her a picture because I feel my eyes right now. <laughs> no, I was gonna say, I don't know if I'm like trying to I'm gonna force it. Okay, but, but like, I gotta feel a little something. I ain't gonna okay. lie. How, how fast happened. do these supposed to work? What are the directions at? No, for real. Let's <laughs> ask Sylvia, actually. Let me FaceTime Sylvia next. Cause... Oh, yeah. Sylvia, the one. Let me not put out the. Okay. They're going to be like, oh, uh, yeah. We know who to get. We okay. know who to pick up. My eyes are. Sylvia having like... a bad, a bad look. Okay. She like, my cotton got hit. Let me Let's look it up her. on Google. Yeah. It's probably 15 minutes. But last time when I had ate, ate them with Sylvia, that shit kicked in instantly as soon as I ate that second. I was gonna say, because we, how long we just take it? Like five minutes ago? <laughs> shit. I'm gonna know Thanks. when it's working, because, well, I don't know if I'm gonna have a different experience. I ain't gonna know until I'm driving, bitch. I feel like I was in speed racing. No, nah, when I was looking at my phone, my shit looked weird as hell. It's like if I look like directly at light, I feel my eyes low. Because last time it took it like 30 minutes, but. Most people feel the effect after 30 mm. Mm -hmm. Onset time starts 15. Oh, no, that's tea. What about the chocolate bar? Oh, they got tea? I'll try that one. Oh, no, I, I couldn't. I feel like that tea. shit would taste disgusting. Ugh. You got to put some lemon and honey up in there. Girl, that's going to defeat the purpose. <laughs> <laughs> How many pieces we ate for it, right? Yeah. Time will begin 20 to 40 minutes. 20 minutes? I bet. I mean, I can feel something going on right now already. But I think that's like that onset type, like, you know, like the jitters, kind of like, well, no, nah, I don't want to sound like that, because I got to, <laughs> that kind of sound like that white stuff, but like, it's like, my brain just feel like it's jumping, like, it went like, I don't know how to explain it. Back in like 15, 10 to 15 minutes, because how long, how long ago did we take it, like 10, 5? Yeah, like, look, I'm trying to, watch oh, here Sylvia. Oh, here's Sylvia. Hey Sylvia, say hey. <laughs> we just took. Oh, wait, I told them don't forget to get your reaction when you get your gift. She <laughs> is irritated. Oh, yeah. Okay, so that's what I got her for her birthday, y'all. <laughs> oh. You know oh what that is? God. Yes, of course. <laughs> What is this? Okay. It's like a, you can store your weed in it, or she probably gonna use it as an extra. That's right. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna say because it's a nice little top, so you don't got all the dust and shit coming out yes. too. But yeah, this was that's raw. Yeah, I, I think like she that. gonna like it. Yeah, she really don't like that much. <laughs> <laughs> oh my
energy called Hawaii Ice Cream.